Hello all. I know I haven't been on social media for a while. That's a story for another day. Um, I just have to get on here hoping that this video will go super viral because it's the most disgusting thing I've ever heard in my life. Hopefully it'll be just a part one, but it may be a part two. Um, fact. Uh, my daughter became a widow um, January 27th of this year. On February 12th, she took, in fact, she took to the her bank um, copy of the death certificate to take him off the account. Um, he was on SSI. Of course, she has not received any payments since then as well. Never, not one uh, since then. So those are two facts you have to keep in mind. Okay, she goes to look at her bank account yesterday. She's supposed to have approximately $1,600 in there. She has 70 cents, 0 0.70 cents. Of course, that's a, quite a shocker. So she quickly goes to the bank or calls. I'm not for sure. It doesn't make a difference. Um, and find out, oh, well, it's like a garnishment was done. A garnishment? Okay. They're only supposed to take out a certain percentage. That's number one and leave a certain amount in, in one's account. They didn't do that, of course. Um, and come, so she called the, the collection agency. And come to find out, it was some kind of, of a hospital bill relating to her husband, her dead, deceased husband. Okay, well, she tells them, well, he's been deceased since January of this year and um, has not received any SSI payments, not a one. So they ask her to send the death certificate, a copy of that, and the statements. And, of course, all that is proven, proven beyond a shadow of a doubt. They said, yes, we should not have garnished this because he is not, the, you're not liable for it. Um, based, that's what they told her. Now, okay, so she goes to the bank and, and tells them the whole story. Um, and come to find out, here it is April, and they still have not taken uh, her deceased husband's off the account. So she presents them with another death certificate. And still to this day, right now, um, he's still on the account. They can't seem to take them off. What bank is this? U.S. Bank. I want them boycotted. Um, they will not admit their error. And it looks like this is going into a part two, and I do apologize. So it's going to be a part two. Sorry.